Have you ever noticed your virtual machines are suddenly turning off? In this case, I have four virtual machines here inside of Hyper-V, they're all off. This could occur for a bunch of reasons. For example, licensing in Windows, which you can always check. But what I wanna show you is the issue I had this morning. You can look at the event log and you'll see uh, what's going on, but essentially it's a little hard. You'll have to check in the Hyper-V VMS logs. You can go under applications, service logs, Microsoft Windows, and then inside of Hyper VMS. And in there, you could take a quick look and see what's going on. Essentially, this doesn't give us much helpful information. It says, you know, event ID 19080. It's talking about a disk merge, nothing major. So no big deal. But now moving over to the Hyper V worker, we'll notice at 7 a.m. we have a virtual hard disk problem with current state disk is full. And you'll notice that that's the main problem in this case. So initially we had exported the virtual machines over to a location on the same disk and this caused the issue. We forgot to delete them after we had recopied them over into Hyper-V in the proper spot using the import wizard. So we went ahead and removed it and the issue was resolved. Now we have one terabyte of free space. Hope this helps. Please like and subscribe and turn on notifications. Thanks.